and welcome back to my Liverpool series on FM14 guys. So before we go into the game against Everton, the Merseyside derby, which it happens to be the first game of the season, I'll quickly show you what happened since my last episode. We played the whole pre-season, we're undefeated, but we hardly played anyone good, apart from Anzi and Schalke really. Um, against Claremont Foot, this is probably the most dominant games I've had. Well, obviously, this is only the third game in, but that is ridiculous. 38 shots to their zero. Probably should have beat them about 8 nil. And, um, yeah, so the next one, again, I'm not sure if this was as dominant. Yeah, we had, ten well, we had more possession, more shots. I don't really know that team, to be honest. And against Schalke, this was even more impressive at home. Again, we probably should have beat them by a more convincing scoreline, but we had 28 shots to their six, more possession, which is pretty tough with that. And the last game was against Philadelphia in the USA. So we took the lead with Sacco, they equalised, they got a dodgy penalty, scored that, and then Sturridge equalised, but again, we had more, more shots, more possession. So we're going to go into the game against Everton. I'll quickly show you what's happened first in the like, transfers and stuff. I kind of realised, um, what is it, transfer history, kind of realised uh, I was looking for my staff to show you what I've brought in. Got rid of all like the shit people, because they did have a lot of shit players, um, shit players, shit staff. Uh, I mean, he's not that bad, but brought in my own, probably still need to buy some more. Going to sign Honda, I need like centre mids. Um, I've only got Joe Allen, Steven Gerrard and Henderson. So... Seeing as a play, I'm going to play this formation probably for the most part. I'm going to play two centered, uh, mids and a defensive mid. So I'm going to need another one. So I've got him on a free. So he's come in uh, when his contract runs out. So he'll come for January. And I tried to sign him, which obviously is probably one of the best youngsters in the game. But Schalke were not having any of it. I tried to unsettle him, but maybe if we do get into Europe, might be able to do that successfully. Um, but the two players... Like brought in, um, I literally let's have a little look. Yeah, it's a free transfer, <clears throat> uh, a right wing back, just for the simple fact that we need back up to Glenn Johnson. So he's on a free. He's pretty good. Uh, he's a good player for the Premier Division. You can't go wrong with that. And this guy, his scout reports were good for the Premier League. Bought him for about 1.8 million, and he's worth about 3.1. It only says he's decent. But his stats are better than that, I think. I think he'll turn out to be an alright player. So he's back up for Lucas. And other than that, our squad's okay. It's pretty decent, to be honest. So we shall go into the game against Everton. So as the tactic I showed you, I'll be using this one. Kind of like a 4-3-3. Three, three, with Gerrard as the advanced playmaker. And Henderson as the box-to-box -box midfielder. Coutinho is the inside forward. Cut, cutting in, he's got like a free roam. Sterling's going to kind of stick wide I could have done with another winger maybe but I can also I can always have a look before I mean the, the deadline's not till what the 2nd of September or something like that so it'll be all right so let's go into the game um, I'm just hoping the uh, match sound doesn't isn't ridiculously loud because I remember on the last game it was I've kind of tweaked it a bit but hopefully I don't really know what it'll sound like until I finish recording so they are playing Leighton Baines, Jackie Elka, Heitinger, Coleman, Howard, Ovidio, uh, whatever you say his name, Darren Gibson, Gareth Barry, Pinar, Manuel Fernandez, and Lukaku. So it's a pretty solid team. See my team there. And let's go in. So we can have general. Tell this one's for the fans. Okay. If they're all listening keenly. I'll do calm. Hmm. Yeah. Let's go with that one, and that one, and this one. Okay, so let's go into the game. Right, <clears throat> so we have, yeah, they've started off with more possession, which is a bit of a shame, even though we've got the ball. It's only two minutes in, so we've got Coutinho, and he gets fouled by Pinar. Let me just check what I've right at TV. Yeah, I'm not playing re um putting replays on. It's just a bit annoying, to be honest. A replay every goal. So we're passing it around quite nice here. Coutinho's going to go in the winger. He's going to cut inside. And he gets tackled. This is a long highlight. 
I bet it'll just be like a P roll shot as well. Lucas. He's quite pushed up for my liking, to be honest. Gerard. Ah, oh, there we go. So we got more possession, more shots, and again we're on the attack. Gareth Barry, though, they're on the counter. It's the wing backs that I'm worried about. <clears throat> How much space to get, from my point, exactly right there. But, um. And they take the lead with their fair shot on goal. That's pretty brutal. Um, we had an alright start, and then they just counted us. So let's see if we can come back into this. I'm going to keep the same. I'm not going to tweak anything as such yet. Um, this doesn't really seem. They're having more possession as well. Oh, Glenn Johnson's just made his equalise, though. It's not offside. It's not offside, is it? No, it's fine. There we go. That's fine. We're back in We're back in the game. <laughs> we're only 1-0 down anyway. But it is, again, another set piece. It's a storage. Oh. How did he miss that? Anyway. So it's an alright game so far. I don't understand why they have more possession, though. We should be dominating the midfield. We're definitely dominating the shots. And the possession is starting to get there. So it's 1-1. We definitely want to win this. I'll probably... um. I said, I won't really do anything if I say the fans again. I'll just say we've. Um, I'm happy to keep your performance up. Listen keenly. Uh, um, solid defence. Yeah, just make them ex as excited as I can. He looked to switch off. That's pretty shit. All right, there we go. So, if we, um, if I make some subs maybe in the 60th minute ish, and then we'll look to go attacking. I don't really like attacking with this formation. I've tried it out and it's pretty it's pretty poo. But there's no highlights we're gonna oh there's a highlight there. Let's just watch this. I've got him to pass it out short. I don't know why he still does. I know it was a goal kick and all, but he stood should still like pass it short. Henderson just boots it at him. It's a bit of a strange one. So Coutinho. What can he do? Sterling. Oh what a save. Is it going to be a highlight still? I'm not sure. We're dominating the game. Um, oh, Lucas is on a book. And he, he's dirty in real life, but he's class. So, storage. I'll make a sub after this attack. Definitely. Oh, Coutinho. Right. Um, I'm tempted to bring off Lucas. Enrique's had a shocking game left, left uh, wing back. So, I'll bring on Kakirias and Suzuko. The attack's fine. Storage hasn't had a really good game. Five, that's fucking disgusting. But we are dominating the second half. I'm going to go attacking as well. We need to kind of make this shit count. Yeah, apply advice. Don't score. Oh my god, he hit the post. I think that was a post or either. Mingley made a good save. I do want to get three points here. We've absolutely dominated this game. I'm going to keep Gerard on even though he's picked up a knock. I'm going to really bring on Joe Allen instead of him. Oh, Sterling got a bit of luck there. Johnson. Oh, Johnson scored! He's <laughs> it's a double from Glenn Johnson. You don't really see that a lot. But yeah, let's go back to control. Oh my god, there's a highlight straight from kickoff. Oh wait, no there's not. That's a lie. So let's waste some time, make some subs. Well, I can only make one. Um, yeah, let's take off Gerard. Let's maybe... Uh, I haven't even got Gerard on the bench. Oh, shit. I thought I'd put him on the bench. Okay, I can't take off Gerard. That's a bit annoying. I'll bring on Moses then. And I'll remember to put Gerard on, on next time. But that should be it then. It should be bringing on a sub and then we win 2-1. <clears throat> yeah, there we go. First win, guys, of the season against Everton. I don't like how it says that because if you say that and they, they perform well, so they don't, you know what I mean. It's best to keep the uh, the moral high. Right, let's do this. Right. Um. So yeah, as you can see, twenty-three shots to their nine, ten on target, more possession. That's what we like to see. Glenn Johnson. Glenn, blah, 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 blah. Glenn Johnson got out of the match, and he fully deserved it, to be honest. Don't know why I can't see that little bit, though. I don't really know what the, why this is a bit too far up. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, that was pretty good.
So let's quickly, hopefully this loads pretty fast. It should do. There's no reason for it not to. Right, okay. First victory! Yay! <laughs> that's what we like. <clears throat> and so yeah, that puts us in seventh place and our next fixture is away at Hull. But the one, the next game I'll do is probably the end of the month, so it looks like it's going to be Fulham, <clears throat> unless that changes. So yeah, we'll have Fulham. Actually, no, I'll do Man City because obviously it's Man City, so you want to see Man City. So I'll do Man City as the next game. So we've got quite a few games. So hopefully we can. This formation has looked pretty decent. We dominated Everton. They're a good team. Um, they got a bit of luck to take the lead, but yeah. So thanks for watching, guys, and subscribe if you want to see more of this series. Bye bye.